I want to talk to you about uh, white supremacist violence, which has been mentioned a lot. But before I get there, I'm actually concerned with something that I consider pernicious and very difficult to root out, which is the realities of implicit racial bias that lead to larger systemic racism. Now, I've been kind of stunned that the issue of systemic racism has become something argued over, but if I can just walk you through for a second, um, does our justice system treat people equally in this country at this point? Sadly, and uh, it's plain to me that uh, that is not that it does not. Uh, and I'm going to stop you there. I mean, Brian Stevenson <laughs> says we have a criminal justice system that treats you better if you're rich and guilty than if you're poor and innocent, because one's uh, finances make a difference often with what kind of justice one gets. Is that correct? Senator, there's no que question that there's disparate treatment um, in, in our uh, justice system. Mass incarceration is a very good example of, of, of this problem. You know, we're incarcerating 25%, uh, 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 almost 25% of the world's population, and, and we have uh, you know, something like 5% of the world's population. I don't think uh, that uh, that is because Americans are worse. Uh, but what uh, well, underlies me... that is the uh, disparate treatment of uh, blacks and uh, communities of color. Assuming this position where you are called upon for that MICA mandate, what are you going to do about this outrageous injustice that persists and infects our society with such a toll on black and brown communities? Right. So there are many, many things that the Justice Department has to do in, in this regard, and I completely agree that uh, the uh, disparate results with respect to wealth accumulation, dis uh, discrimination in employment, discrimination in housing, discrimination in healthcare availability, all of which we all see now in the, in the consequences of a pandemic which affects communities of color enormously more with respect to infection rates, with respect to hospitalization, uh, and ultimately to death. So. Well, what, uh, one set of things we can do is the mass incarceration example that I, uh, that I, that I began with. We can um, uh, focus our attention on violent crimes and other crimes that uh, 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 put great danger in our society and not allocate our resources to something like uh, marijuana possession. Um, uh, we can look at our charging policies and go uh, and, and stop charging uh, the highest possible offense with the highest possible sentence.